A new state-of-the-art prosthetic device called the X2 is helping wounded veterans achieve increased mobility and, as a result, improve their quality of life. This artificial knee features advanced technological capabilities, and until recently, the X2 was only available to veterans wounded in Iraq and Afghanistan. But now, the first Vietnam veteran, John Lucen, is being fitted for this highly advanced prosthetic. Some 42 years ago, John lost his leg above the knee. It happened during a mortar attack in Vietnam. Since then, he's had to wear a prosthetic knee. And now, thanks to VA, he's being fitted for one of the most advanced prosthetics available. What I'm getting now is a complete new uh, design all around. And uh, it's, it's a dramatic, dramatic change from what I'm, I'm used to. The new device, called the X2, comes complete with microprocessors, sensors, and even a gyroscope. It offers amputees like John more freedom of movement, enhanced balance, and a better life. Traditionally, amputees will bear all of their weight through their good leg, and it begins to fatigue and tire. With the new prosthesis, it has the programming allows him to shift and the knee automatically locks at a flexed position. It's kind of what we, what we do normally. John is being helped by VA physical therapist Lindsay Martin, who's been working with him at the Walter Reed Army Medical Center in Washington, D.C. It's a great partnership already. I mean, she's enthusiastic, she's encouraging, patient. You know, it was a good match right away. Good. While this new prosthetic device will certainly help younger veterans return to active lives after an amputation, it promises to help older veterans like John, who as they age, can also lose their legs to disease and accidents.